Hello everyone and welcome to another unboxing. This one is courtesy of Owen over at Human Worth Records. So before we get started, I want to say thank you to him. This one came from across the pond, so it might take me a minute to dig in, but let's get the old trusty pocket knife and get started. <laughs> I'm tired of opening this box. Ha ha! I cannot be undone! Unless I can be undone by a different box, but not that. Okay, so, once again, let's try this. <sighs> Unboxing Human Worth Records Part 2. Okay, so, this label has been extremely, extremely gracious with sending music videos for the Monuments and Ruin podcast, uh, or the music show as you might have seen on YouTube, and their label and releases are all phenomenal. Very, very impressed with everything, so be sure to, first of all, check them out. That is Human Worth Records. I will send a uh, link in the description and I will put it on the screen. Human worth. Look at that. Starting off with a stack of cool promo postcards. Thank you for that. Lots of stickers. So if you're ordering human worth stuff from me or something else, you might even get you a human worth sticker slapped in there. And my favorite, the autographed copy. This says, thanks for the support, all the support. Hold on a second. I'm going to have to read it more clearly. <clears throat> thanks for all the support and shares, Bobby. Hope people dig these records. And here's an extra copy of the MT for you. Enjoy Owen. Man, modern technology, killing it. Thank you for that, Owen, which means this is my personal autographed copy, modern technology. Conditions of worth. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying out some new lights. So, modern technology, conditions of worth. I love this matte album cover you got going here. Looking good. Black with yellow. Oh, very, very nice. Very, very nice. There's the insert. The real me you'll never see. See what we got happening here. Oh, very nice. Translucent yellow on the vinyl. Thank you so much for this, Owen. I appreciate it, man. And a thank you for all of your support of the Monuments and Ruin music show. This is staying with the record for sure. I'll get that together here in just a second. So we do have another copy of that, Modern Technology. And another copy of that, Modern Technology Condition of Worth. Get your download codes in there as well as stickers. They're so good about doing that stuff. Fantastic. Up next, Cower, Celestial Devastation. This one, unlike the modern technology, has a nice gloss to it. So, very fun. Very fun stuff. Let's see what we got inside here. We have what looks to be would you call that a green or a gray? Kind of a combo of both, maybe? Nice center label there. I like that center label. Let's see. I'm upside down. There we go. Goodness gracious. Let me just get my hands off of the, the sleeve so we can talk about this center label that I'm trying to show you. There we go. Oh, of course, I'd have to go 180 degrees the wrong way. Very nice. Killer. Killer. So... If you have heard Cower on the Monuments and Ruin music show, I would recommend digging further into their catalog because it is good. Good stuff. Celestial Devastation, thank you for that. Glad to have a copy of that. Another copy. Cower. C-O-W-E-R. Up next. Oh, yes. Fantastic. A.L. Lacey, the name of this album is Lesson. Another of the matte album cover. This one's kind of a... It's, it's hard to describe 
but it's a beautiful record overall. Let's just leave it at that, and you can give it a listen to one of the uh, the links on there. Very beautiful, beautiful record. Black vinyl, A. L. Lacey. This album, once again, is called Lesson. Very nice. Exciting. I'm excited to throw that one on the turntable. Another copy of that one right there. Then we have Torpor. This album. Goodness gracious. I think it was episode 12 of the podcast that we had Torpor. Abs they're going to laugh at this. Abscission? Is that how it's pronounced? They, uh, they sent me a message and, uh, and were congratulating me on being able to pronounce the song title. Here I am uh, feeling I haven't brushed up well enough to say the album title. But either way, this band, absolute destruction. Nice insert there. Got a uh, booklet style poster insert, if you will. Start that way. And then the unveiling this way. Ah! You'd think I would get better at showing this stuff. But no, people, I'm going to keep it raw and unprofessional the whole way because that's the way we like it. Nice and gray. Little piece of. There we go. Little paper on there. Just making sure you don't think that that's some kind of a. A splatter or an awkward thing. Solid gray. Solid gray. I love it. Gray is a great color for vinyl. I think it looks good. I think it looks really good. So there you go. Torpor. T-O-R-P-O-R. -O -O and once again, I'm going to take a, a shot at abscission. A-B-S-C-I-S-S-I-O-N. Probably, maybe, either way, I can definitely back this album. It is solid AF. And we got us another tour pour there. Bam. Good stuff. Beige Palace making sounds for Andy. This one is very, very interesting. Kind of a, I want to say an art rock style blue vinyl looking nice. That looks a, uh, that center label looking very nice with the blue. Got the Human Worth logo on there. I don't know if that lights too much for you or not. Looking very, very nice. Try to keep my, my fingers off of the off of the vinyl as much as possible while we still celebrate it in all of its glory. There you go. Once again, Beige Palace making sounds for Andy. And another copy of that. And then the heaviest of the heavies. Another heaviest of the heavies. Goodness gracious. Does it get any heavier than Torpor? Well, Grubnap might just be that band. This is devastating. The name of the album is God Pile. If you haven't heard this one, I'm not sure if there's any more copies, so you might need to hit us up, but definitely check out Human Worth Records and see if you can grab a copy of this before they are totally gone. Maybe they'll repress them or something because it is monstrous. And it is as black and dark as any soul could possibly be. Very brutal. I love the video that they put out. It's very, uh, kind of makes you feel uneasy, to be honest, which is a, a good thing. Took me a minute. I was kind of thinking, like, Grubnap. What are they getting at with that name? And then it dawned on me. Oh, yeah. Don't be so silly, Bobby. Grubnap. Obviously. The cover kind of says it all. Definitely devastating. And. Oh, there we go. This one's probably just going to have to stay with me. But we'll show it to you anyway. Grubnap once again, ladies and gentlemen. There you have it. Human Worth Records. Be sure to check them out. Once again, I'll put a link on the screen and in the description. Be sure to check them out. Humanworth.bandcamp.com. It's right here. You'd think I would look for more clues as I'm unboxing. But I didn't say I was no damn detective. For crying out loud, get yourself a postcard. Get yourself some stickers. Slap them up everywhere. Once again, you got Grubnap. Beige Palace. Phone Alarms. Tour Pour. A. L. Lacey. Cow 
power and ba 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 modern technology ladies and gentlemen there you go that is the unboxed human worth record stock that's going out at the shop once again my name is bobby owner of inherent records in chattanooga tennessee and the host of the monuments in ruin music show if you get a chance, check both of those out right here on the YouTube page, and I will talk to you all again soon. Be sure to dig into these bands. I will provide some links, support the labels, support the bands, and I will talk to you all again soon. Take care.